Good morning everyone, my name is Tero Hakinen from Ladil and today we are going to look into more new optics that will be released. As you know, light and building was postponed, but we decided we have so many fantastic new products to be released and we just don't want to wait until September. And now we are going to look uh, Ilona Zoom. That's the first, the world's best zoom lens that we will be releasing. releasing. And uh, basically Ilan Zoom is just like any of your 50mm track light optic, except that when you twist the ring holding the sub lens, you can actually zoom the beam angle. The zoom range of the Ilona Zoom is from 10 degree all the way to 50 degree and uh, you can, as you can see, you can change the beam angle smoothly without any steps. What's making Ilona Zoom very unique is that when you are doing the zoom action, you can see the lenses are not moving axially. So the length of your luminaire is constant. This makes it very easy to achieve a very nice luminaire design. It simplifies your design and simplifies your mechanical design of your luminaire. For example, you can have your existing spotlight design that you designed with our standard fixed beam with Ilona lenses. There you have option of spot, medium and wide. And then you can add easily Ilona Zoom. All you need to do is just change this front ring holding the lens in place, this trim part here, so that you can rotate it and it will rotate the sub lens in the front of the lens while you are doing so. This will help easily allow you to add a zoom option into your existing luminaire range. And of course, if you start your design with the Elon Zoom, later on somebody wants to have a little bit lower cost, a little bit more, uh, how should I say, not so fancy, just a fixed beam spotlight luminaire. No problem, you can just easily switch Ilona Zoom into a fixed beam Ilona and there you go. No need to redesign anything. So let's look at a little bit more in detail about Ilona specs. Uh, Ilona family is a 50 millimeter diameter, so it fits into a huge range of existing luminaire bodies, making your design again very simple and easy. The height of the lens is roughly over 3 cm, so it's rather compact in size. As I mentioned, Elon Zoom has a zoom range from almost 10 degree to almost 50 degree, with the LES 6 mm, and you have infinite beam angle options in between. Uh, you could imagine that having such an optical system with all the sub lenses and everything could reduce your luminaire efficacy. However, uh, Ilona Zoom has really high efficiency, 85%, so that's on par with the rest of the Ilona range. No nasty surprises there, which is good. And it has the same easy bayonet mounting into Ledil's Hecla series with the simple twist and lock mounting design. Typical applications for Ilona Zoom are basically anything where you want to achieve a nice spotlight that you want to have an uh, adjustable beam angle, such as, for example, architectural lighting, retail lighting, any track lighting applications. Oh, and by the way, I forgot to mention, Ilona Zoom also is supporting tunable white as well as the rest of the Ilonas. It's compatible with uh, COBs uh, all the way up to 14.5 mm LES sizes. However, the lens is optimized for the LES sizes between 4 and 9 mm. So here we are looking on this short video. You can see more in detail 
the Elon zoom range, you can see how simple twisting of the sub lens changes the beam angle from 13 degrees all the way to 48, easily and quickly. And if you go over the zoom range, uh, then the beam starts to get narrow again. And Elon zoom fits perfectly into museums, for example where you are constantly rebuilding your lighting setup and you need to easily adjust into many different lighting situations and you want to illuminate lots of different size objects. You, with the fixed beams, luminaires, you are forced into having a huge range of different beam angles and this creates excess luminaire inventory that you need to have. All of this is added cost. Having a simple, versatile zoom optic just makes your life so much easier. If you look a little bit more in detail how well Ilona performs, here is the graph where you can see absolute intensity of the Ilona zoom. Uh, one very nice thing besides that the length of the luminaire doesn't change uh, is that uh, with the Ilona we are not limiting the light as you are doing with the lenses which are moving in lengthwise direction. Instead we are really focusing the light in the middle and then we are spreading it wide again. As you can see here we have graphed the peak candlelight intensity. So you can see uh, the lumina absolute intensity of the Ilona zoom optics with the different zoom angles. You can see how not only the peak intensity goes really high on the narrowest beams, but also when you zoom wider, your 10% angle actually gets wider. This is not the situation with the lenses which are moving in lengthwise directions. Quite often those lenses, they just create a small hotspot in the middle, but your 10% angle that means your cutoff angle is pretty much constant with these lenses. This is not the case with the Ilona Zoom. Instead, with Ilona Zoom, you can really achieve this true zoom function, where the, also not only the beam angle gets narrower, but also your cutoff angle is reduced in the relationship. Here we have a couple of luminaire examples realized with the Ilona zoom and a fixed Ilona. As you can see, the luminaire construction itself is the same. In the case of Ilona zoom, we have this rotated, rotating trim ring, and uh, with the fixed beam Ilonas, we can have the same ring fixed. It's still providing a very nice uh, finalized design of the luminaire. Uh, helping to hide away all the technical parts of the luminaire and giving it a really finalized outlook. Here you can see the drawing. Some of, the, some of you may be wondering how do I position everything inside my luminaire, what is the current distance of the sublens, etc. Well, correct position for the sublens is quite easy. You just have it on top of the lens. The sublens will basically find its position accurately from the lens where it's mounted. And then about the turning range, your uh, angle from the narrowest beam to the widest beam is roughly about 18 degrees. We have marked on the sublenses and uh, the bottom lens. There is a tiny mark on the lens itself, which is giving you the narrowest position. And then you can rotate that lens so that marks will slide further away from each other to achieve the widest angle. So Ilona Zoom in a nutshell, it's a patented, it has the highest efficacy in the market. It's a perfect light, capable also achieving tunable wide performance. It fits into the same luminaires as existing Ilona range. It has a zoom range from 13.5 all the way to 48 degrees. This with the 6mm LES 
if your LES size grows bigger, then also your beam angle range will be wider. So, so your beams will be wider in both ends of the zoom range. Ilona Zoom is compatible with up to 14.5 mm LES size COBs, same as rest of the Hecla compatible optics. Thank you. Happy zooming. <laughs>